What's going on everyone? Coach Kyle here. Welcome to today's video and we're going to be showing you how to do a proper dumbbell tricep kickback. This is very highly requested. I know a lot of you are doing this exercise at home with your lighter weights and everything. So that's totally cool, but you're going to be losing out on a lot of gains if you're not doing it properly. So basically we're going to start assuming that you have a bench or a couch or something like that. This is the best way to make sure that you're keeping your form nice and tight, but I'll show you a variation after if you don't. So um, basically starting off, getting in the position just like you're doing a single arm dumbbell row, except you're not gonna get your leg nice and wide because it'll kind of get in the way of keeping your elbows up. So pretty much stretching yourself out on the bench, okay, leg in nice and tight. You're gonna wanna lift your elbow up, okay, up to about here, and then just do a kickback. So holding onto it, elbow up, boom. Boom. You know, you wanna make sure that you're avoiding keeping your arm down. You try to keep like almost like a 90 degree angle, keep it nice and tight, and then just kick back. Kick back. Boom, okay? So this is a very easy to follow exercise. However, I do find a lot of times, and this is what we're gonna do is just jump into the common mistakes. There's a lot of people who are doing this wrong. So the number one common mistake I'd say is just improper body positioning. So if you don't have access to a bench like this, what a lot of people do, is they'll grab a dumbbell, they'll stand up, and they'll just do this, okay? This is just a weird variation of a bicep curl. Sometimes people go like this, sometimes people are all the way up here, sometimes they're down here. You wanna try to get your body almost parallel to the ground to make sure that you're getting the best full range of motion and that way gravity's working with you, not against you, okay? So essentially, once again, being parallel, trying to get your body nice and flat, not up here, and doing this, that's how you're gonna get the best out of this exercise. And number two is just using way too much weight. I'm not even kidding. I see some people use like, this is a 10 pound and I can do 10 to 15 reps and get a nice squeeze, nice control, nice time under tension and it'll give me great benefits. But a lot of people will grab the 30s, they leave their egos, they don't leave their egos at the door and they'll just go up here and they're just, <sighs> okay? They're just doing that. You're not gonna be doing anything for yourself. So that is common mistake number two. And then common mistake number three is just improper arm positioning. So this is very common because people use too heavy weights or they just forget that, you know, you're supposed to have it up here. It's supposed to be almost like a 90 degree angle. So they'll start here, they'll kind of get just into this position. And then as the reps go down, then their arms are down here. So you really want to make sure that you're just keeping yourself all the way up. Okay. 90 degrees, 90 degrees. A lot of times, once again, people let their arms go down here and it just turns into this and you're not doing a whole lot. So for those of you who don't have a bench or anything, I really wanna recommend just showing you what I recommend you doing is just kind of setting yourself like this, imagining that your knee is a bench and just go, get down nice and low and just do it like this, okay? That's how you're gonna get the best results possible and that's what I really recommend. You can also do this with a cable, which is tremendous if you have access to a gym. This is a great exercise, very overlooked, an amazing accessory to really kind of target those small muscle groups in the triceps. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. So hey, make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel. If you want a free form guide, make sure to click that first link. It's a free personal chain in your pocket. You won't regret it. We'll see you in the next video. Peace.